Close your eyes and allow all your thoughts to settle down. Thoughts have been spinning around in the mind all morning. Think of them as being like a big flock of birds, and they just settle down on the, the wires, on the telephone pole, every place that's available. And they just stay there for a while. If any of them goes flying off again, you don't have to follow it. It'll come back. And if it doesn't come back, you don't, you don't have to miss it anyhow. We give so much importance, importance to our thoughts. You know, thoughts can be really damaging. If you, a lot of them, if you believe them, can lead you to all kinds of stupid things. So just because a thought appears in the mind and begins to fly around doesn't mean you have to track it down. It's, in fact, it's an important skill, learning how not to get interested in your thoughts. So you can turn them on and off at will. It's not that the Buddha wants you to stop thinking entirely. He just wants to give you some more control over your thoughts. And so one of the first stages in getting control of them is not jumping on them every time they start flying around. Because who knows where they're going to fly to. And if you're not skillful in getting disentangled from your thoughts, they can lead you to all kinds of bad places. So for the time being, just let everything settle down, settle down. And you stay settled down even though other things may be flying around. That's the second important skill, that there's going to be a lot of activity around you. The simple fact that your heart is pumping blood through your, your blood vessels. There's a lot of circulation going on in your body right now, but you don't have to circulate around with it. You can just stay right here. That's to say nothing of all the activity going on around you all the time. Some people think that in order to meditate they've got to find a quiet cave someplace where there's no noise and no disturbances. But even in a cave there's lots of disturbance, the disturbance in your own mind and in your own body. So what you've got to learn to do is settle down in the midst of a lot of other activity. Other things may be moving around, but you're not moving around with them. And there's that fear that something important is happening, you're missing out on something. Just learn how to drop that fear. The most important thing in your life is what your mind is doing right now. So you can watch that with your eyes closed and without getting involved in anything else. So watch that right here, and don't be worried that, that you're missing out on other things out there. What you're missing out in is distractions, other people's business. You've got to learn how to take care of your own business, get your own mind under control. That's the first order of business. And the first step in that is learning how to step out of your thoughts, not get involved with them. That way, when the time comes, you can step in, step out, and when you know what you're doing, not simply through force of habit. So learn how to settle down in the midst of activity. You stay still even though other things are moving around. Once you've mastered that skill, you've gone a long way to training the mind.